we had the advisory council, and then in 2010, I made the decision to transition out of the university and to work with Clint to lead the education, start and lead the education division of Speeder Group. So now we're in the beginning of 2015. We're 20 partners into this journey in K-12. So glad Scott Lingle is here because we're one year into a partnership with the University of West Georgia, beginning to learn to what that transfers like in higher education. And Scott has just been instrumental in the work that we've done at the University of West Georgia. We just signed an agreement in working with South Louisiana Community College and Lafayette Community, uh, in the Lafayette, Louisiana community. So we'll be kind of working in the community college as well. So we're just, so in, in many ways, we're beginning to grow into more adulthood, so to speak, in the K-12 area. And we're just beginning to expand into the higher education arena. So what we've learned and what you'll see today and tomorrow You'll hear from us, our team a little bit, but you'll also hear from the people who have done this work in school districts, the leaders who have done the work in school districts. And then I'll spend some time tomorrow telling some stories. I'll just highlight some school districts and telling the stories and showing some results of what their work has meant to them. So today what I wanted to do is spend a little bit of time connecting the dots and also giving you some time to reflect on where you are and where you are as a school district and where you think we are in the state of affairs of K-12 education in this time of change. Because just as healthcare is going through change, we're going through our own change, whether it's higher ed with performance-based funding, or it's K-12 with figuring out if we're gonna have this thing called the Common Core, which has become an ugly word, to, um, you know, to, to different types of assessments or what that means in terms of the changes. You know, we just, we, we really don't know what those changes are going to represent. So what we, what I